Hello, my name is Jason Solomon. I'm the principal of Cody High School. This is a community that I'm familiar with. I grew up in the area, and it's always been a strong community where people surrounded you and supported you from elementary all the way up into high school. So the opportunity to come to Cody, to come back to my community, really excited me to give back to the Detroit community. We have a lot of supports for our students. Uh, we have a development center where students can go in there and they can talk about things that they're going through outside of the classroom. We love to consider the whole child, the emotional side as well as the academic side. In the classroom, we expect our teachers to build a strong relationship with students before we even start learning. So a lot of our students have a really good relationship with their teachers. Uh, they can talk to them about things that's going on inside the classroom as well as outside the classroom. My support system is my teachers, my coaches, my family, and my teammates. They helped me to like overcome my fears and be a better person in school and out of school. Here at Cody High School in the classroom, our instruction is phenomenal. We love to have students engaged. We want students to have fun while they're learning, but we also want to challenge students to be the best that they can be. Academics is the number one thing that, uh, you know, I try to stress to our young men. I told them I set a team goal for the team grade point average to be 2.5 or higher, which will give them all potential to you know, qualify collegiately. Um, those are, are big goals for me because uh, one thing I do know as an ex-professional athlete myself, you know, life goes on after sports because we all have to retire. No one plays sports forever. And you have to have a, who you are defined as a human being and not just as an athlete. The ultimate goal for Cody is that when kids come here for their freshman and sophomore years, we're building their skill set, um, that they're strong in uh, English language arts, math, and the sciences, all of the core subjects. And then when they get to their junior and senior year, we start to put them in career pathways, whether they're attending vocational school, whether they're doing dual enrollment, um, whether they're doing summer enrichment programs, where kids really get into things that they are interested in and they can start to build for tomorrow. You will be coming to a well-rounded and a balanced environment with tremendous support from the teachers, the staff, uh, the administration, as well as the student body. And uh, continuing to build that culture and get it going in the right direction is our number one goal here at Cody because we want to have, again, positive, productive students so that they'll remember their high school experience as a wonderful experience. Here at Cody, we are building our fine arts department. You can do piano. Uh, you could be in a vocal choir. We also are building our photography and art program. And also we have our informatics where you can get into career health fields and you can explore the different careers in health that you may be interested in doing. And we have a partnership with Microsoft called Microsoft Teals where you can do computer software programming. So all these are exciting opportunities. The advice I would give a new student here at Cody High School is sign up for every program because high school don't, high school don't last forever. So you want to do everything you can while you're here. What they teach me here at Cody is to not to be afraid to speak up and just try your best not to give up and just have fun. Some of our partners who've gone above and beyond for our students, uh, supplying them with basic needs when they didn't have them, um, picking them up, giving them rides, um, food, their families, it, it, the list goes on and on. Through the Cody Rouge Initiative, some of the things that are happening through the partnership are, for example, the Cody Rouge Community Action Alliance. They always let us know if they're doing things, whether it's food giveaways, tablets, school supplies, those sort of things, whenever they're happening, we're able to sh shoot that out and provide it to students and families. And then also with summer opportunities. Right now, for example, Ms. Ward came into our classes virtually on Monday to begin recruitment for GDYT summer job opportunities. They have 150 openings and they try to provide some of those slots for Cody students. So right now there's at least 50 set aside for Cody students. So getting down to not just the communication, but also drilling down to make sure that we try to be intentional about what we're sharing and to ensure that it's able to be activated on. We are looking for students that are looking for the opportunity to be great here at Cody High School. And so when we get our new facility, it's going to be a great opportunity for kids in this community as a neighborhood school that they can get whatever they need here, right here in their community. We have a ton of after school programs, coding, robotics, athletics. We have foreign language, band. We have other programs that are coming to Cody. We have a beautiful medical lab. We have weight rooms. We have fitness areas. We have a beautiful football field, track. We have a lot of things in this neighborhood that aren't talked about, but they're here to help our young people to be better. We want you to be challenged here. We want you to be everything that you dream to be here at Cody High School. So please come join us. Again, it's one Cody, one community. One Cody, one community. One Cody, one community. One Cody, one community. One Cody, one community.
We are One Cody, One Community. One Cody, One Community. I hope to see you here in the fall.